Hey, fire signs. Hope you're ready for your weekly reading with the Duchess. So, first of all, we're going to start off with our Aries. So, Aries this week, it is all about temperance for you, okay? Um, with temperance, we bring in a lot of cooperation, a lot of control, a lot of being kind of moderate and even. So it's not really going to be a week of major extremes. You're not going to have these highs and these lows, or even if you do have some highs and lows, you're going to kind of take control of the situation, especially internally, and, you know, kind of just bring things to balance. I really feel for some of you that you're overcoming some high level energies like maybe sometimes you're over the top maybe you may blow your lid have a little drama you know or sometimes you may be really kind of low and solemn and in solitude and this and that and this week is not really going to be about that okay it's really going to be about let's keep everything balanced let's keep everything temperate let's keep everything controlled i really feel like for a lot of you this is i'm getting chaos is finally being um like dispersed like there's no chaos okay like we are creating a safe place for ourselves I, I feel like you're really creating a safe place for your energy and you're not going to allow anyone to bring any type of nonsense in whether it's chaos whether it's just low level energies you're not for it this week it's all about being temperate controlled working towards a good goal um staying in a good energy space so i really really think this is very good stuff here for aries love it love it love it so sagittarius here mm, sagittarius is sitting in the devil this week and you know what this means and if you don't know now you will know okay you got some things you gonna be addressing this week or maybe some temptations coming in, okay? So the devil, of course, is always that temptation. The things you ain't really supposed to be doing, but you may be doing it or, you know, fears that are holding you back from certain things that you should be doing, but you ain't doing it. Codependencies, addictions, all of that. We gotta overcome this Sagittarius, okay? I know everybody has a different type of feel. Um as to, you know, what it is that they need to address. But this is the week of addressing things. This is the week of overcoming those negativities. This is the week of telling the devil, mm-mm, not today, devil. We ain't doing that. We are staying on a good note, okay? Um, I don't want none of your tainted fruit because I'm going to get me a fresh and delicious peach instead, okay? I know what's good for me. I know what's healthy for me. So it's really about... You know, stepping into your health this week, Sagittarius, it's about releasing anything that's holding you back from stepping into your health. Um, so if you're feeling like, oh, I can't really do it, that's this devil energy right there. And that's exactly what you got to release. Denial is also part of this, okay? Because you can't lie to yourself or none of that. You got to be real and know that you've got things to overcome and that's how you are able to to overcome them by being real with yourself, acknowledging, and then working towards it because it's going to bring so much light and positivity and good stuff into your life. You're going to feel a lot freer whenever you release these burdens. What I like here is like this devil's in the background. That's what we're leaving it. We're leaving that negativity in the background, okay? And we're moving forward completely away from that. So good stuff, Sagittarius. Now we're on to our Leos. Leo. You actually got you a little fiery card here with the Knight of Wands. So, Leo, y'all are ready to do something different. It's like you're ready to move forward is what I'm really getting here. It's not even that it's something different. It's something that you've been kind of wasting time on. It's something you kind of been just like chilling in the background. You're not really moving forward. I feel like some of y'all have really just been stuck. And Spirit is saying this is the week where you're actually going to start making movements towards something that is important in your life whether it be a person place or a thing okay with this knight of wands energy it's like you're being very passionate about this movement for some of you it's going to be something kind of swift you're just going to move in for some of you you're going to have to fight some demons first you're going to have to you know push that fear back and really just step into it one toe at a time that's okay one step is better than no steps is what spirit is saying and so as you step into this if you have any apprehension any fear that's okay that's normal just brush that off to the side let your light lead you and then you will be so successful at being able to finally move forward and getting out of that stuck 
energy, being out of that. I'm in my mind, but I'm not, you know, really doing anything. And so Spirit is saying this is going to open up a lot of doorways for you because as you move forward, you're actually opening yourself up for blessings. You're opening yourself up to receive and to go into new experiences, which is always a blessing, whether it comes in positive or negative, because that's really just a growth lesson and a learning lesson for you. It was really a pleasure to bring this to you this week. Fire signs. If you like these readings, please subscribe, subscribe, like, share, comment, all that good stuff. If you want a personal reading, the details below in the description box. It was definitely a blessing. And until the next time, bye.